What are those? I gave them to you. Oh, kitty and pickles. Do you like it? <laughs> okay. Hey, what's that over there? Dad, are you coming? You already saw it. <gasps> <laughs> one at a time. Pick one out. Take it out. <gasps> that open. Rip it. <gasps> it's okay. What is that, Liam? Whoa, show me. What is it? Wow. Okay. Is there more? Ooh, what's that? Oh. What is that? What is it, Liam? Do you like it? Wow. <laughs> it's so squishy. <laughs> is there more? Oh, what? Oh, can you help him? That's a big one. <laughs> oh my gosh, that's a big one. <gasps> Liam, what is it? Oh, a big one. You like that one? <laughs> oh, wow. Wow. Oh my god. That's so cool, huh? Ooh. It's a big one. There's one in there? Yeah. Yeah. I think he goes on the robot, on the big robot. Ooh, so many pieces. That is wings. Mm -hmm. Happy birthday, Liam. <laughs> All right, so here's some footages from the party. This is the dessert table that I put together this year. I have some Rice Krispies, donuts, the cake is from Manzu Bakery and I put or I had her make it into like a Bakugan type of game board. I just put Bakugans on top and some cookies. These are all Liam's favorite so he picked everything out. And this is what our basement looked like. It was raining all day so it was, you know, good that I had set it up for inside um but anyways these are all the food that we had we had pancit egg rolls adobo crab rangoons lots of chicken and rice we had all that stuff and everything was gone by the end of the day which is fantastic i think we just had some like chicken left over so yeah hey,
So towards the end of the day, the weather actually cleared up a bit. It stopped raining and some of the kids actually went and jumped in the pool even though it was so cold outside and windy. Um, but since it stopped raining, we were able to go outside and do the piñata which was great because I know that Liam was really looking forward to that. Um, he put so much time and effort putting all the candy in there and he even picked it out from the store. So yeah, I'm just really glad that we were able to do that as well and all the kids enjoyed it. All right, hi loves. I hope you enjoyed seeing a little bit of Liam's birthday and his party. You guys know me, I don't really like vlogging too much around other kids um, just because I don't feel comfortable with it and stuff like that you know it's others like it's someone else's kid and I don't want to put them on the internet like that you know what I mean so anyways I hope you guys like seeing a little bit of the party um, it was such a good day like I was really dreading it because I knew it was gonna rain and I was like oh my gosh what if there's no room inside but everything worked out everyone was comfortable there was room for everybody and it was fun the kids had a lot of fun and I feel like that's what matters the most is the kids have fun um so yeah anyways for the rest of the video today is actually Thursday I have a lot of things to do one of them is to clean up my car. I mean, it's not bad, I'm gonna show you, but I thought I would just like wipe things down, vacuum the floors, and just like put things back where they should be. Um, I don't know if you've been following, I haven't had this car. I think it went to the shop in March, like early March, and I got it back just end of July. I don't, I don't remember, but it was gone for like six months so I was driving the Porsche for six months and now Tom has that one because I love driving that car don't get me wrong like I've always wanted one but I realized I prefer this one being a mom um, I know this is like a weird tangent but um, just I just want to talk about it I guess um, but I prefer the Lexus because it has more room it really does. It has a bigger um, back seat area, um, especially with the car seat, and then the trunk's about the same. But yeah, I don't know. I guess I guess I'd rather have this one, being a mom. But I do love the Ford Porsche because oh my goodness, driving that is so fun. I love driving that one more than this one. I really do. Like, yeah. I really love that one but this one has like the 360 camera that I absolutely love it has a camera button so you can turn it on whenever um, which that is like a must for me I hate parking especially nice cars I, I don't even want to so like every time I park the Porsche I park super far away from people um, but anyways yeah I'm glad we, we Tom has that one though like I think we're keeping it so um, I love that car. So if I if I want to be like a cool mom, <laughs> just kidding. Anyways, um, yeah, we're gonna clean this car out. Um, I guess it needs to be cleaned. Um, my I'm going somewhere with my mom this weekend, so I want her to be comfortable. And if you know Filipino moms, they're gonna be like, "Ew, your car's dirty." Like I don't want to hear any of that. <laughs> so I'm gonna clean my car. I'm not gonna clean the outside because it's like rainy out today so even if I bring it to the car wash it's still gonna get all ucky and yeah so I'm not gonna bother about the outside but at least the inside will be clean right so let's go ahead and do that <laughs> okay so this is my car I mean it's not dirty or anything when I got it back it was super clean um, I think they cleaned it but yeah so not too much stuff um, I do have a few things here and there so I'm gonna like get everything out and then we're gonna put everything back in um, I do need to this is like Liam's emergency bag for whenever we leave the house this is always in my car so I'm gonna be leaving this actually at home and putting it in Tom's car so when I'm gone he can take this with him but see there's just like little things definitely need to vacuum um, so she's beds there because when we go out of town, 
the trunk looks like this. I'm gonna empty this out. I don't even know why this is there. I do want to get um, the plastic. My Infinity had it, and the Porsche has it. It's like a just like a plastic thing for here, so it doesn't. I mean, I like this. It's fine, but um, it gets dirty. The plastic one, you can just like wipe down clean out and everything so anyways i'm gonna take all that out let me just open all the doors i think there's some okay yeah see so she's bad and then uh, the driver's side of course there's garbage oh i'm also gonna get rid of this do you see that this is what always happens with this trash can that i got um i got this last year when i got my the car um i bought like little trash cans like these and they just don't stay together um, in the doors. Even in the passenger doors, they don't stay closed. It just like pops open like that and falls out. So I got new ones. I'm going to show you guys that. But okay, let me put you on a tripod and then we can get to work. Oh boy, it's starting to sprinkle. But I am gonna be using this for all the leather surfaces. Alright, so these are the new garbage cans that I got for the car. This is going to go in the back and then these, one for the driver's side and one for the passenger side. I like these more because the whole top, it doesn't come off. So it's not like the other one, you know? Um, so yeah, that will be very, very nice. Also got um, this one, the pink one, came with little trash bags. I thought that was great. These ones didn't come with it. This one was $13 though, just because it's pink. But I wanted a pink one for the back, just because it's cute. And then these, just for the black, it's two for $12. It was like 11 something. So definitely cheaper for the black one, in case you are looking. I will link them all below because they are on Amazon. Anyways, look how cute! It's perfect, and they do come with clips. So this one's gonna be clipped on in the back, on the back side, and then these two are just gonna go in the door. So I didn't, I didn't put the clips on them. But I thought these are so cute and so much better than the one that I have. This one, like I said, has the clip, and I'm just gonna go ahead and clip it in the back here, and it just kind of slides like so. Isn't that so cute? Love it. And then I have a tissue back over there. That one's also from Amazon, and it came with the tissues, which is really nice. Don't use it that often, but yeah, so this is what the back seats look like, and that's all I'm gonna do for back here. It's all clean. 
and yeah that is the best I can do with the vacuuming love it okay okay so I didn't clean in here yet but I just want to show you how this fits so I have like a water bottle and this I'm gonna get rid of it because as you can see it's like falling apart <laughs> so here we go see it just fits in there perfectly and it's not gonna fall apart I love it love it so much all right time to clean this mess of an area look at that oh it needs to be vacuumed so badly Target. I had no idea they existed. It is the Kleenex on the go. And oh my goodness, I'm just gonna put it in my car, like right here. Or I can even put it in the passenger, which I think I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna put it in the cup holder here on the side door, right there. Look at that. Trash can and Kleenex on hand. While I'm driving, there's like fuzz everywhere. Um, but yay, that's awesome. I love that. this chair left to do but I really like these um, leather wipes they work really good they're not the wettest which is good so it doesn't leave too much streaks or anything like that um, but yeah woohoo all right guys I'm almost done with the car but I thought I would show you this little pouch I've had this for a few months now but it's by Gelato Peak and I love that brand. I actually sent this over as a gift for Mother's Day. And let me just get in here. Ugh. Okay, so what I keep in here are my must-haves. As I showed you earlier, that one's like mainly for Liam so we take that one from car to car. But this one I take with me in this car it's just for my emergencies so right here I have wipes I always have wipes and then the big compartment here this is what it looks like in the inside so the wipes go here and then you have one big compartment so I always have acetaminophen for headaches I have deodorant for you know in case I have tampons and pads um, I have a trash bag hand sanitizers and then this has lotions body lotion hand lotion lysol eye drops dramamine tissues hair ties band-aids so just kind of like an emergency thing 
for myself or even for Liam, you know, just in case we have all that stuff, um, in case I forget the other bag. So this one always stays in, in my car. I love it. And I always have an umbrella as well in my car. So, yeah. We are gonna do an unboxing, um, so yeah. <laughs> Oh, here's one more. So some of these packages I've gotten like weeks ago or even end of last month. It's just I haven't opened them because it's been crazy busy. So yeah, um, I always set them aside and never forget. <laughs> so they just pile up. So we have a lot of unboxing. But anyways, it's really raining now. While I was cleaning my car, it was sprinkling, so I really hope my footage is good. Um, anyways, <sighs> we have a package from NARS. This is Creme de la Bronze. Oh, wow. Laguna Bronze and Creams. Ooh, okay. One thing about me, I'm not very good with cream things. I always have a hard time blending, so this is going to be like fun experimenting so there is apparently five five um shades in this and they're 38 dollars each and oh my goodness look at this brush i can't wait to try this out let me know in the comments if you guys want me to do kind of like uh try it out with me because again i'm not very good at cream cream bronzers especially blushes i can work with but like bronzers i always have a hard time and it always looks patchy but wow, this brush looks so nice. I will link everything below that I'm going to be sharing with you. Um, wow. Okay, so this one is Laguna 03. And then they also sent over Laguna 02, which is the original. Let's see which one is lighter. Okay, I'm going to keep the 02. And in this video, I will be giving away 03. So I'll have how to enter down below in the description box because I do not need. Anyways, I'm excited to try this out. Let me know if you guys want to see me try to use this one of these days. But look at this combination. Is it going to focus? Oh my gosh. There we go. Come on, calm down camera. There we go. Perfect. That is the color right there. Oh, I can't wait to try this out. Thank you so much, Nars. Right, next, we have Laura Mercier. You guys know me, I love me some Laura Mercier. Oh, I always love their handwritten notes. So last time I think I opened with you was new blushes and highlighters. And I've actually been using their blush that I got recently and I love it. It has replaced my other favorite from them. It's just perfect for summertime. It has a little bit of a shimmer to it, but it's so pretty and corally. Oh, 20 blushing. We know you'll have more than one favorite. <gasps> There's 20, what? Oh, these are lipsticks. National Lipstick Day. Okay, this is totally new. This is called the Petal Soft lipstick crayons and this is what they look like totally new i have never tried that from laura mercier before i've always just tried their lip liners and their actual lipsticks oh and some of their glosses but this is new wow do i have all the colors i don't think so but <laughs> it got conjumbled two four six there's ten in here though Okay, let me put it in there nicely and then and then I'll show you guys because the packaging is so cute. I don't even want to get rid of it. Oh my gosh. I'm going to be using this this weekend. I can't wait. So look at this cute packaging. That is adorable. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Okay, so... This is a 12-hour sheer matte lip color and the collection of 20 universal carefree colors have been developed to suit all personalities and skin tones. Oh, okay, cool. So you can see the colors in the bottom like that, which I love. So let's grab all of them and see what colors we got. And follow me on Instagram so you can see where I'm going and I'll post me using these. 
so you can see what it looks like on because I'm not swatching it now because I look like a poo. <laughs> wow, we, oh, I see some pretty nudes. Okay, let me grab them like this. This is such pretty packaging, first of all. like It's like this beautiful blush pink. You guys know me, I love that. They sent me some really good ones. I'm not big on bright lips. You guys know that I like more of a nude. Um, everyday type of colors. <gasps> Do you? Oh my gosh. Oh my, oh my gosh. Yes. Yes. I don't want anything too bright for the weekend. But I also don't want anything too, too nude. I kind of want, do I want to be fun this weekend? <laughs> I'm going somewhere with my mom and my sister and I'm really excited because we've actually never done a trip together with just us three. Um, so I'm really excited. So, okay, I'm going to do, let's just swatch it. Okay, so this one is Ma Maya, Maya? I'll swatch it on my arms so they can all be next to each other. Wow, that's very nice and smooth. And then this one is um, Amelie. Sorry if you can hear the TV. Liam's watching in the living room. This one's Leia, which this one's like perfect for every day. I'll bring you guys closer in a second. And this one is Agnes. Okay, I'm gonna bring Leia and Agnes. So here's my swatch on the arms. I love them! Oh, I can't wait to try them out. Love, love, love it. All right, next I have Glow Recipe. Okay, I have two packages from Glow Recipe actually. Okay, look at this cute packaging. It says Bedtime Stories, The Village, and Glow Fairies. How cute. What? It's an actual book. Look how cute. Oh my gosh, I can't wait to read this later. But I want to show you guys because this is adorable. Oh my gosh! What is this? Watermelon Glow AHA Night Treatment. Oh my gosh, I love their watermelon line. Oh, I can't wait to try this out. Thank you so much, Glow Recipe. I'm excited. So this is glowing, radiance, and smoothing. Ugh, I can't wait. I can't wait. Thank you. And it's already in stores on their website and Sephora. So I will go ahead and link that below as well. So it has, oh, okay. So it's a gentle exfoliation for smoother skin and refined pores. It's also good for hydration. So it will leave your skin plumpy and juicy. Um, it also is good for evening out your skin tone and brightening it. It says 96% agreed skin has long-lasting hydration. 93% agreed skin looks glowing and radiant, feels smoother and firmer. So here you can pause it so you can read. I am excited to try this out. Wow. Yeah, I'm excited. I can't wait to try this. I might try it tonight. Okay. One more from Glow Recipe here. I think this one came before that one, to be honest. Oh, fun. What is this? Glow recipe. Check out these dew drops hacks from creators. So, oh, this is their dew drop. Okay. Oh, look at that. A little thing with a spatula. And. Watermelon Glow Neosinamide Dew Drops Ultimate Glow and Brightening. It's a serum. So there's that. I have tried this before, I believe, and I do really like it. Except I think this one has, um, maybe this one's a little bit of a different one. 
I don't remember the other one being shimmery. So I'm going to have to check this out and see which one I have. Um, but I do like their serums as well. Again, I love their watermelon line. Everything I've tried from the watermelon line has worked for me. So I'm pretty excited about that. I don't know what this is. So I'm going to have to definitely look up these hacks. So I'm keeping all my little cards here. Two more packages, you guys. These last two are from my friend Stephanie, um, SL Miss Glam, here on YouTube and also on Instagram. I love Stephanie. Um, ever since I started YouTube, she's always been there. She's always been a good friend. Um, we don't talk as much, but, you know, we're busy moms now, which is so crazy to say. Um, Liam, Liam was born in August of the same year that her girls were born September so like same year they're just like a month apart it's just it's so cool so anyways she is so kind and she had some new releases recently and oh my goodness she sent me I don't know which one this is she sent me her brushes I believe and backpack which I'm like oh my goodness so oh my gosh okay so this is the backpack and she asked me to pick a color and usually, you know, I'll pick like pink and beige, but I actually already have pink and beige backpacks. So I'm like, let's do a brown and it can be fun for fall. So I picked brown and okay, look at this. Isn't that the cutest? And look at her little girls. Mia and Sophia are growing up so fast and so beautifully. Like they are the cutest. And oh my gosh, congratulations, Stephanie, on this release. These backpacks look amazing, and I can't believe I have one here. Like, oh my goodness, you guys. Oh, it has a little dust bag, which I love. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. Yeah, it is the perfect shade of brown. I'm, I'm probably going to use it this week, I'm not going to lie. This is so cute. Look at this. Look at this. Okay, so the hardware is gold. And it's just so cute. It's a magnetic closure up here. And you have your big compartment. Oh, I love that lining color. Beautiful. Oh, I love that the inside is this color. I don't like bags with dark interiors because it's so hard to see what's inside if that makes sense so i love that this has this um beautiful like off-white beige color oh i like the pockets so good and then there's pockets on the sides here plenty of room so these are considered mini diaper bags but honestly you can use it for whatever. It's a mini backpack, which I think is awesome. And love that there's a pocket there as well. So this is so cute. Thank you so much, Stephanie. It's such good quality. It's so like supple, if that makes sense. It's such a soft faux leather fabric. Oh, I love that there's a little handle here and that this is also this full leather material and the straps they're squishy so they're not gonna hurt your shoulders oh my gosh i love this thank you so much stephanie it's so beautiful and congratulations i might need this in beige <laughs> this is such a good color for fall though oh my goodness one more package from stephanie this one is the beauty so i'm guessing it's makeup brushes i believe she just released a set and her makeup brushes are stunning, you guys. Oh my gosh, she sent me so much. <laughs> oh my god. There's two things. So, let me just take that out. Oh my gosh. Oh, it's a sponge set. Okay, I need sponges because the one I have right now is starting to kind of get crumbly from washing it all the time. Oh my gosh. So this is Baby Doll. And that kind of brings me back to when I started YouTube. Um, 
If you didn't know, my username was BB Doll <laughs> back in the day. That was always my username for everything. I don't know why, it just it just was. So it kind of reminds me of that. It's so cute. I love the packaging, by the way. Oh my gosh. <laughs> so much. Thank you, Stephanie. I actually do need new brushes because I've been using the Laura Mercier ones and some of them are just starting to go bad, you know. Oh my, oh my gosh, they're all so soft. All right, I'm going to open them and then I'm going to bring you guys closer so you can really see all the details on these brushes because they are so beautiful. So I'll be right back. All right, guys, here are the makeup brushes. Look how beautiful they are. There is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Oh my goodness, they are so beautiful. I love that the handles on these are like resin or plastic. So different. And I love that like there's rivets right there so you can like really hold it. And my favorite part, everything is labeled to what they are here you can see better flat brush like this is so awesome again congratulations stephanie this is a stunning collection i love these brushes they are so beautiful i cannot wait to try them out okay and this is the trio sponge set oh wow okay so it says on here that it is Latex-free, hypoallergenic, and you can use it damp or dry, which is pretty awesome. And what is this? What is, seriously, what is this? Oh my gosh, I am such a noob. I don't know what this is. Can someone tell me what this is? Or do I? Oh, oh, I get it. So you set your sponge on here, right? And let it dry. I love that. I love that so much. Okay, and it's a cute little heart. That's so cute. Okay, so we have... Ooh, we have this kind of sponge, the shape with the flat bottom there. And you have this one. I've never used a sponge like this, so that's totally new to me. And then this one. So this is the kind of sponge that I'm currently using right now. Oh, I'm excited. Everything will be linked below, you guys, if you're interested. Thank you so much, Stephanie, for all of these. And thank you, Glow Recipe, Laura Mercier, and NARS. Everything will be listed in the info box down below. Also, giving this NARS bronzer away, Laguna 3. If this is your shade, check out the description box, and you can win this little guy. I'm going to make it super easy, so yeah. Um, and that is it. I'm going to throw in some of these, by the way. Some of the Laura Mercier lippies with the NARS. So you get, you know, more than one thing. Um, but that's it. Thank you guys so much for being here. I hope you enjoyed my vlog. I hope it's not too long. Um, but yeah, I'm excited. Um, yeah, that's it. Thank you so much for being here. Love you guys. And I will see you all soon in my next video. Bye.